Hi everybody, this is Matt. Thanks for watching and welcome back. You know what? One of the things that I really love about this channel and doing these videos is you. You, the viewer. And the reason for that is the interaction that we have. Where you ask questions, I answer them if I can. You make comments that are often very thought-provoking, gives me other ideas, and you know, keeps me revved up about one of my passions, which is the shooting sports. And one of those moments happened today. I look on the channel and I see this comment and uh, it was related to this Sig Sauer P229 Legion. On my initial review of the Sig P229 Legion, I had related the fact that I would got it from the gun shop in the afternoon, I went to the range that night and went to shoot it and the people on the range are going, oh, oh, is that the Sig Legion series? And I'm like, yeah, you want to shoot it? Well, this was a team of uh, college athletes that are into the shooting sports in a big way. They shoot competitively. They know their stuff. I know these guys. And uh, I, I never thought twice about it. But the person said in the comment, that was really nice of you to do that, Matt. Well, you know what? That made me think. Of course. I wanted them to enjoy this. I wanted them to be able to hold this in their hands and to shoot it. And I guess one of the reasons why is because I specifically remember when I was around 14 years old, I was a uh, shooting trap and here I am with a just a single shot shotgun. And there was one gentleman on the range one night and he had this superior grade, uber fancy 12 gauge full choke shotgun that I was literally drooling over, literally. And I would look at him when he'd come back and step off the line and uh, uh, it was really obvious. So here's this kid going, ooh, that is, oh, that's just so wonderful. And you know what the guy did? He came over and he's like, hey, look, buddy, uh, I noticed that you're looking at my shotgun. You wanna, you wanna shoot around with it? I'm like, oh, really? Yeah, yes, absolutely. And I did, and I tell you what, I felt on top of the world. Like I had just scaled Mount Everest. And it was just like, oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, but that act of kindness that he extended to me is just something that I like to pay forward. I mean. I got my passion for the shooting sports from my dad, who was just a consummate outdoorsman and overall sportsman and one heck of a shot. Uh, experiences with that fella just kept me stoked and just furthered my passion. So what I'm getting at here is there's a lot of people out there and with today's economy and stuff like that, you know, you've got in that situation, college kids that are going to have buku student loans and all that sort of thing, they might not be able to afford one of these for a while. So this Sig Sauer Legion might be the only thing that they would ever have a chance to shoot in five years. Why wouldn't I let them have that experience? Especially when I know that they're a great bunch of guys to begin with. Um, so I'm just simply paying it forward. But I really didn't think about it until you made that comment. And I would encourage each and every one of you, especially when it comes to the youth of America, uh, sometimes seemingly little things that, that you don't think make a difference really do in the lives of people, especially when they're young, especially when they're in their formative years. If you tell a young person that they can't do something, that'll stick with them. Uh, on the other hand, if you encourage them to do something, that'll stick with them too. And it can just go on from there. So one of the great things I love about the shooting sports is we meet some really fine, upstanding folk of exceptional moral character, caliber, and you know, it's just great. So I would encourage you, keep your questions, your comments coming and pay it forward because you never know who you're going to influence for the positive. And it's always better to be a positive influence than a negative one. So until next time, thanks for watching and everybody be safe out there and have a good one.